This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. Well, Kurt, the next week for the Go Home Impact prior to the big Genesis event, there's an opening promo between Sting, Bobby Roode, you, and Bully Ray that sets up a six-man tag main event against James Storm, Abyss, and Jeff Hardy. Uh, this is a full 12-minute segment. I've cut it down, but we're going to share some of that segment here. Here we go. Let's uh, check that one out. First of all, Robert Rude, you need to shut the hell up because I'm pretty sure these people are sick and tired of you doing this. Now, Mr. Kurt Angle, you look like you got your uh, mouth uh, shut. Is it because it's wired from that last call super kick? Now, you want to you wanna go around and you want to make fun of me? Hey, that's all fine and dandy because people have been doing that since day one. But I am the only cowboy, James Storm. Now, you want to go to my hometown of Leapers Fort, Tennessee, and you want to beat up my buddies, one of them that just got out of the hospital. Good old boys that like to drink beer. Well, Kurt Angle, a couple months ago, I stood in this same ring and I looked at you eye to eye. I seen a man who wasn't intimidated of nothing, who was not scared of anything. Now, I see a man that's a little scared. He ain't scared. He ain't scared. Because you know, you know now, you're a little worried because it only takes one last call super kick to knock your lights out. Now, since you, uh, since you like to beat up on my buddies, uh, old cowboy James Storm brought one of his little buddies here. And you know what? He likes to drink a little beer, too. Hey, don't drink that beer! Don't drink that beer! Don't drink Now, you look like you're about to pee yourself, or you want to say something. Yeah, I got something. Shut up, Kurt. I'm talking. Don't you talk. Shut up. Bully Ray, for months, you and the rest of Immortal disrespected and took advantage of me. And now you realize you need me. You and Immortal need my power and need my strength and need my size. Well, you know what, Bully Ray? I don't need Immortal anymore. All I need is you. And at Genesis and that Monsters Ball match, I'm gonna make you pay. I'm going to make you suffer for all the sins of a mortal. Ho! Oh! Shut your mouth, just like he said. Shut up. It looks like, it looks like, it looks like, it feels like we got ourselves a main event for tonight, a six-man tag. You, 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 I guess you, you, and you. Woo, ta-ta! <laughs> All right, Kurt, so who we are. I, I got to ask, since we're here, Bully Ray. How'd you like working with him? Thoughts on uh, on Bully Ray? Bubba Ray, as a lot of few people know from WWE. I love Bully Ray. I think he's uh, one of the most creative talents in the business. The way he structures matches, puts together promos, uh, he, he did such an incredible job. Uh, I knew that he would have a great singles run after his tag team run, uh, because he's that special. He, he, he is definitely, um, a, a locker room leader and he deserves all the success that he's had. 
Yep, and he's gone on to have a successful uh, show, podcast himself with Dave LaGreca. And, man, he just has some hot takes. Uh, but, man, he has got a mind for the business. Uh, that is for sure. A mind for the business. What he knows about the business, especially, you know, psychology and matches and different ideas that he had that were very innovative. Yeah, he was really special. Well, they set up this main event. It would go to a non-contest as it goes off the air with Bully Ray choking Abyss out with a chain, you putting Storm in an ankle lock, and then Rude puts Hardy in a cross face. What did you think of this match? You remember this match and how uh, you know they set this up going off the air? It was a pretty solid match, but what I loved most about it was the heels, uh, the go-home uh, TV, the heels got heat on the baby faces. That was a necessity. I need to get heat on James. And uh, Bully Ray needed to get heat on Abyss. And, you know, everybody, all the heels needed to get heat before the pay-per-view. Well, it certainly accomplished that, to your point, Kurt. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.